We're back from the red carpet of the Emmy Gala with a very special guest, uh, Rosemond. Thank you. We promise that it's going to be a fun interview. It's going to be so much fun. Great. So first, you look gorgeous. Uh, who are you, you wearing very tonight? Much. So I have the absolute pleasure of wearing Meza Yaya. It was so much fun working with Yasmin. We uh, discussed what I wanted to wear on the red carpet. I wanted something kind of flowy and feminine and just I didn't want to wear pure black so she incorporated the blues and the purples. Looks great. Thank you. you and then we accented it with uh, Roger Vivier and then of course Roberto Coy in jewelry. Beautiful. Uh, how important is such event today uh, for Dubai, for the world, for the fashion industry um, you know and your participation as well of course. So what stands out about the Emmy Galas is what you'll see tonight, all the viewers tonight. It is over 18 countries being represented tonight. Um, honorees have traveled around the globe from the US to India, um, all across the Middle East just to be here to celebrate. And it's actually such a beautiful evening to be with your industry peers um, and also just artists in the community to celebrate arts, culture, film, television, and of course fashion as well. Uh, this year's gala, we saw yesterday some panels and we saw some really insightful discussions about fashion, fashion with purpose, and a lot of our guests today are talking about fashion with purpose. Um, how important is that? How important it is for the fashion industry to always be focused on having a purpose, especially when it comes to women empowerment and it comes to also enabling dreams around the world? So I really loved Manish Malotra's interview last, uh, last night and he was talking about the next generation and I just thought that was so nice being such a famous and legendary designer he has no ego when he's in the office and I can actually say this because I've been to his um, showroom and his atelier in India and he is always with all his team he's like his hands are there he's sketching he's working he's embroidering he's working with everyone from different generations and I think that kind of exchange and dialogue is what propels a brand to excel Great, and we, you mentioned that 18 countries are represented yes. today. It is important to bring the world together today, and the more we bring the world together, the more we are you know, promoting peace and promoting uh, you know, uh, diversity. 100%. Uh, Dubai is an embodiment for that. So uh, how do you find Dubai first? Like, uh, I always de describe Dubai as it's the best of East meets West. It is safe, it is embedded in value systems of family and, um, you know, prosperity and, and the leadership. I mean, we're so grateful to be here. This is great and uh, we're going to actually end this interview with a message you'd like to share with all the viewers today, with all the Emmy Gala participants as well. Well, I would like to say a big thank you to everyone watching at home tonight. Um, the gala kicks off very, very soon live, so make sure you're following. And of course, um, to all of our honorees who've traveled honestly around the globe to be here tonight. It is going to be such a fun evening, so much entertainment, lots of celebrities. You can see everyone kind of coming in the red carpet. And I promise you a very glamorous night. Thank you, Roseman. Thank you. And now we go back uh, to Mesa and the team. 